Present television. We are everywhere. Hey, GK, me, Mr. Man. The student of Anglican Girls Secondary School, Newe, Anambra State, accused of forging a unified tertiary matriculation examination, UTME, result, has broken the silence. In a video that has gone viral on social media, Mesoma said she's surprised that a result she printed out from the jam potter could be termed fake by the exam body. The student repeatedly said she's not capable of such, further disclosed that she's traumatized by the claim. Mesoma, I'm doing all these results. I went to jam potter to print this result, and this is what they gave me. This is the result here. This is exactly how I printed it. I downloaded it from that site. So they now saying that I forged my results is what I don't know. And I'm traumatized that they accused me of forging my own results. Because I'm not capable of this forging results. This is the evidence. Okay, they say that I forged my results. They scanned this QR code there. And they, it showed another name. A Yoruba name. Omotola Afolabi. 138. And that same person that got 138, they checked again, the person got 338. Meaning that there is problem. There is problem somewhere. Mesoma, who claimed to have scored 362 in the 2023 UTME, was recently celebrated and awarded a 3 million Naira scholarship by Innocent Chukuma, chairman of Innocent Vehicles Manufacturing Company. But the Joint Admission and Matriculation Board, JAMP, described the result as fake, saying our original score was 249, but was manipulated to 362. But the Commission vowed to withdraw the unified tertiary matriculation examination results of Ms. Omer over alleged manipulation of her scores. She is also to face prosecution for allegedly deceiving the public to fraudulently obtain scholarships and other recognitions. Meanwhile, the Anambra State Government has, has instituted a panel of inquiry into the controversy. The State Ministry of Education said the investigation would unravel the truth about how Ms. Ejikeme got her results. Present Television. We are everywhere.